Welcome to my tutorial on how to invite a user or client to see his coupon under construction in the inactive coupon section or category. To do this we first start on San Diego Promos coupon um, section and there we have a nice scrolling thing. We will see down here in the bottom there is something called inactive which is inactive coupons that cannot be viewed at the moment and there's a little, little pop-up showing that you're not allowed to access this directory uh, unless you are registered aren't invited so we'll have to invite a client to see the coupons that is under construction we do not want to show it just to the public we have to be approved so we're gonna lock in here as Raymond and the moment we do that, we'll see that there's three more options up here in the navigation bar. Uh, your account will be visible even to registered users or any client you decide to invite when they have created their account. But these two sections here is only for us to view. And we also see down here on the bottom, now we can, inactive is now possible to access. And we can then see all these coupons under construction. But we also want our client to see this, so we'll invite him in invite user bar up here. And we'll immediately pick a recipient as an email address. In this case, we'll choose Alexis. No, we will not choose Alexis. We will choose, you can keep it hotmail.com. And we'll put in a pre-made um, text that I have already created. And I recommend doing this, like, for example, in a notepad which I have done here. Uh, basically have some pre-made text that you like to use uh, that you have worked on earlier and that really sounds good and I've created this little text here that I just copy paste copy I right click in here and I say paste and it's right in here and it says please create an account to log into the coupon section and see your coupon under construction in the inactive coupon category this will help the client to understand what it is he has to do when he gets to the website. But let's see what happens. Uh, right now we sent this invitation to the client and it says that we have invited one email is successfully sent to invite our friend. Um, we log out now because we're done as a rate now don't because now we're gonna see what the client is going to see when they go to their email inbox here. Uh, let's refresh it. And we are going to see an email from San Diego Promo. As I, we can see here, there's a link here that the client can click and there's a description of what it is that we want them to do. Uh, and the very important part is this, please use this referral code. The reason why it is pasted in like this is because they might have to copy this referral code as it is called, because that is the important key for them to be able to create an account uh, and to be referred by you. It's also in the link here, but not all browsers allows this to be auto-populated into the bar, and we'll show you in a moment, because some has not enabled cookies correctly. Uh, so the browser is very much dependent on that, unfortunately, because we do not force it on them uh, as many sites does. Um, and we have our instruction that we wrote down here also in the bottom so they still know what they're going to do the client will hopefully click this link <laughs> and understand they'll be redirected to the site in our case it auto populates the referral code placed down here and we'll put in a name in this case you just use Alexis Evanoff and a username when you desire fortunately it's already in use so we'll use another name and it's not in use. Text for all these things which is really awesome and they can put in any desired um, email address here. This email address is already in use. We'll use another, it's all good. I've been testing this a lot and then you can see the client will see a green 
check off that it is correct, which is, is a, as far as I can see, is a really great user experience. Um, the password, any desired password, there will be a test of how strong the password is. And before they, uh, they have to agree to these terms before they can register. And the terms are some generic ones, actually, but they are perfectly fitted for this purpose because the information, illustrations, text, and images here and after referred to as content on this website are protected by the laws of copyright. And all these things about how they are uh, allowed to share them and whatnot. So they have to agree to these, they cannot click this button until they agree to the terms. Uh, and the moment they push register, they'll be redirected to the front page. And they will now be able to log in. We can now go to the coupon section. And they'll be able to log in. with a username and their password. And the moment they do this, they get automatically redirected to the inactive coupon section, which perfectly shows here under construction. So, that was the tutorial of how to invite a client to see the inactive coupon section so they can see their coupon under construction.